Hooray. Uh, yeah, time for more of this. Gotta finish this game up, because if I don't, who will? But, um... Yeah, I don't know what to say about this. This level, this game's not one of my more popular playthroughs, I understand. But, I mean, I only got six levels left, so let's finish it up and never speak of it again. Starting with Rail Lift. Don't care what the lucky fruit is. And picking the light blue Yoshi, because why not? I have good, like, quality now, and you'll actually be able to make it out against the background, unlike before. Uh, this is actually my second attempt at this. I got about five minutes into the level and then failed. Uh, I'm very confused by this level. This one I'm doing blind, as I did with the last one, uh, the last, like, World 1 level, just to see if I could do it. Um, probably not a good idea, actually, but... Yeah, I don't know. I can't explain it. You have to just see. Like, I'll see if I can get it to happen again. Every once in a while, Yoshi will, like, find something when I'm starting to sniff, and then there's nothing there. It must just be, like, a problem with the level, but... And now that I've mentioned it, it's not gonna happen again. I just know it. Ugh. Okay, let's just... Yeah, get rid of this. Okay, yeah, now he's not finding anything. Oh, wait, there's something. Was it actually something, or was it a myth? Uh... Wait. Yep, it was a myth. There was nothing there. What the hell? And now suddenly there's a melon here. Okay, sure, why not? This game makes no sense. And also, for as much crap as people give it about being easy, like, including me, I frequently say that it's easy, it's really not. This game is actually quite unforgiving in a lot of ways, which hopefully we will not be seeing in this level, but I imagine that we probably will. As, like, with this, but... Okay, here's... Here's a strategy for you. Actually plan ahead. Don't be an idiot. If you see a melon in a bubble, over a pit, move the bubble so that it doesn't fall into said pit. Because the timing on eating that is really awkward. And now we walk and we sniff. And I don't care what you have to say, but let's see anyway. Oh wow, you can pause in this game. Okay. And recorder, what the hell are you doing? I like skipped there, but I don't, I don't know if it'll show up. Let's just... Okay, this level is called Rail Lift, is it not? Let's, like, actually get to the Rail Lift, because that might be interesting. So far, this is a fairly boring level. A whole two inches into it, of course. And please tell me I didn't have to, like, step on each one of these. You can never tell. Sometimes they hide stuff in the most random locations ever. So... Yeah, of course I get hit by that. Uh, hey, you. Come back. Okay. And we are sniffing some more, because that is what we do in this game. Honestly, I don't know what to talk about in this level, because I'm, I don't know what to expect. Okay, I will assume that that was it for this area. I guess I'll find out when I get the sixth, because usually they put, like, hidden coins near that when you get the super happy hyper seizure fruit. Super happy hyper seizure fruit. Yay, okay. Uh, it would be nice to, like, kind of roll with it, but... I have to sniff out melons, which are stupidly hidden. I don't know why they would put stuff under these, like, message blocks, because it's really hard to pound under those. Okay. This is a cloud. I wouldn't call this a rail lift, but I'll go with that. Grab you. Let's hope that this doesn't become difficult. I mean, it's like, yeah, I'm going from Kaizo 64 to this. Like, 
like, what has happened to me? But, and yet, this I'll probably find harder, because I'm weird like that. Uh, okay, can we, like, get on the cloud? Would be appreciated if I could. Okay. I don't know what's going on. Yay, melons on strings. Someone will probably make a sexual joke out of that. <sighs> yeah, th th this is this game. It's just me failing at it, pretty much. If you're new to this series and haven't watched all the other levels, uh, expect a lot of this. Come on. Watch as a 22-year-old plays a game meant for 5-year-olds and fails at it. No, it's okay. Let's just move on with it. Now that I've seen the rail lift, I'm already sick of them. Of course, it's just coins. Next, I will do a all coins run. No, no, I won't, because that would be terrible. Um, hidden coins piss me off, because I think I'm going to find something cool, and then I don't. By something cool, I mean the one thing that's in this game that I want. Uh, what, what did I smell? I know I'm supposed to hit that thing, but I'm not going to yet. Because I might have to, like, clear out the level. This is a World 1 stage, so I'm not expecting severe difficulty here, but you never know. So much sniffing. Whoa. Okay, that was kind of interesting, I suppose. And here's, uh, here's a mystery to ponder. Uh, how did I ever get anything done with the old 11-minute time limit? Because, like, I'm a third of the way through this level at best, and I'm already, like, seven minutes into it. What the hell? I guess that's what happens when you do a blind run of a level, but I managed surprise pretty well, I think. I'd have to rewatch it, I don't remember. I might have failed epically. Epically, I say. Oh my god, that was so hard. And we stand here for five minutes, and then super heavy, terrible beast. You didn't see anything. Must always make a joke with the water. And it must always be the worst possible joke you could think of. Zomg uh, Oh yeah, hearts. I'm supposed to be getting those too. I kinda forgot about those. Uh I mean not die, please, like And we die. Great, okay. Editing time! And, uh, yeah, how about the fourth freaking recording session for this single level? I am clearly not good at this game. I did learn that you can hit the hearts with eggs, though. It makes this part slightly less terrible. Also, I probably could have just shot the, uh, switcher to make the thing move. So yeah, I kind of know what's coming up now. Um, did I get past this goddamn bumper? I hate it. Okay. Let's, uh, there we go. Okay, this switch, th this thing here, oh my god. Uh, as soon as you hit this, it starts a timer, and you have to basically rush through this next part of the level. And, uh, it's a bit scary if time limits are not really your thing, and they're not. I hate time limits. Because I suck at this game already. I don't need to add a time limit to it. But yeah, you gotta just rush through it and try to get all the melons that you can along the way and try to not die. Uh, switch. Okay, thank you. And run! And, uh, here we go. Got this one going. I gotta land on it and not die. Okay. There should be another switch coming up soon. That'll be helpful. There we go. Shoot this thing too. Damn it, I missed one. I'm gonna fall off because I suck at this game. Come on. 
Okay, super hard for it. Uh, grab you. Uh, I gotta, like, clone it. Oh, God. Uh, okay, you go up. And you go up. Egg. Eat. Eat. Eat the melons. Okay, thank you. I think I pulled this off. There's one in the bubble there. These, yeah, these two here are the ones that the timer triggers. And then the last melon's right there. Uh, where is the third heart? I have absolutely no idea, and I don't really care to find out. Because this was a travesty of a segment, and I'm glad to say that it is officially over. My god. Uh, I might be doing the next one blind, too, but from what I remember, it's like... 90% sniffing and stomping the right spots. So, I don't know about that. I might, like... I might prepare a little bit. Okay, and now about this upcoming song... They're not saying the asshole. They're not saying together. They're not saying be careful. They're not saying Nintendo. They're not saying anything. Shut up about it. It's baby talk. They're babies. See? The babies didn't know much. They're just singing, okay? This is getting to be very irritating to me, and I know that by pointing it out, people are bound to irritate me on purpose, but come on now. Shut up about it. So after the heart explosion and the little summing, like, re-summing of what we just saw, we now open up to the cavern page, and I only got two of the hearts, so the fourth one is an unlock. Luckily, I don't need it. I'm going for large boiler. So, see you for that one next time.